um, we have an email from somebody who writes anonymously and says, Good morning, Mother. I'm married to a man who's a lax Sunday Catholic. He hates how Catholic I've become and calls me a cult member and over the top. We were married in the Catholic Church and have been married 30 years. I explained to him I'm just aiming for heaven and following the commandments. Well, that's not a very good evangel evangelistic message for your husband. My goodness, it's, it's, a, uh, uh, it's not a loving message, and it's not going to help him. It, to him, it's going to sound very selfish. She continues, my question, I was away this weekend, and I assumed on Sunday he would take my son to a 5 p.m. Mass. It sounds very familiar to a, an email we read recently. She says, I did not want to nag because he hates that, so I did not. I asked him upon my return Monday if they went to Mass on Sunday. He said, no. My son is 15 years old. I asked him why he did not remind his dad, and he said he truly forgot. I think you've sent this email to me before, and I've answered it before. You've sent it in a little differently this time. Um, she writes, I explained to my son that he's old enough to ask his father for a ride and old enough to remember that Sunday is a holy day and the third commandment. Does he have to go to confession before he can receive communion? I told him to say an act of contrition at the chapel, and we would find a confession for him. Please pray for my husband to convert. Yes, he must go to confession before receiving communion the following Sunday. If he's missed Sunday, if he's Catholic, he's 15, he's old enough, and he needs to go to confession for having missed Mass on Sunday. But I'm, I'd be very surprised if this is not the same woman who wrote a very similar email previously, and I wrote to her and asked her why she was away on Sunday. Her husband's a lapsed Catholic. Her son is not very strong in the faith. Why was she away on Sunday? Not that there's not a reason, but I was curious. And she wrote back that one of her children was in a sports game and the other was at a college event, I think, something like that. And so she was torn how to get to both events. And I said, you may have, your priorities are wrong. You chose that over Mass on Sunday. Your husband and your son are not going to think it's very serious. If you're going to go to a sports game on Sunday and another event on, that your children are participating on Sundays and they're not going to Mass, you're not showing the importance of Sunday. Your first duty is to be home with your husband and go to Mass with them. If you're going to be away on events like that on a Sunday, why should they care? Their faith is not very strong, and obviously um, they're going to see that yours is not either.